So guys, in this video, I'll be discussing how I managed to get rich this year by investing in my self-education. Like so this is going to be a really, really interesting video. Now, you know, I do coaching and stuff myself. You know, I have a bunch of coaching students and whatnot. But since the beginning of the year, I've been working with coaches. You know, first I started off with just the cheapest ones I could find because uh, I didn't have much money at the beginning of the year. Um, you know, I took a shit ton of courses. Um, at some points, you know, I had a thousand five hundred in my. You know, I remember in January I got the Ty Lopez course and I had a thousand five hundred in my bank account, um, and I spent nine hundred and ninety-seven on that honest course. Best decision I ever made. Now the course itself, it's not that great, but just the fact that I invested in myself was so, so amazing, you know? So a lot of you guys are kind of on the edge about investing in yourself. And honestly, I can tell you it's the best thing I've ever done. Uh, and it's the best thing I continuously do. You know, I, I, I say this a lot to people, like I'm, I'm not perfect. Like I, I sometimes I wanna buy stupid shit. You know, I would say I'm pretty good with my money. I, I barely spend any of the money I make. Uh, I just, I have, you know, over this year, I've just, ha I have a shit ton in savings so that next year, um, I'm going to invest so much into my personal brand, into ads, um, stuff like that. Yeah, and a bunch of other online businesses getting that off the ground. So like, you know, like I, I have the nicest shit. I have the nicest camera. I have the nicest mics. I have the nicest lenses. I have the nicest vlogging cameras, the nicest speakers I wear nice clothes, but nonetheless, I don't really spend money on stupid shit. Um, you know, like in August, I wanted to buy myself a Rolex 12,000 um, pounds just cause like I thought I'd finally might as well buy myself something nice after having such a successful year so far. Um, and you know, thank God my business mentor told me, Iman, don't be fucking stupid. Um, because here's the thing, my, I, I tell people all the time, oh, it's so simple just to buy success. And that's pretty much all I've done. You need to understand, like we live in such a blessed world where, you know, say a book or a course, like a course, like people complain about a thousand dollar course. Do you know how much money that person spent? Like going through the trials and the tribulations. Do you know how many, how much time they spend? And they're taking all of that information, years, decades of experience, depending on the instructor, uh, thousands or tens of thousands or hundreds of thousands or millions spent. And they're distilling that down into a course for you. So, you know, like it, I find it funny when, when people complain about course prices and stuff like that, and then they'll spend a thousand dollars on a, a new iPhone eight or some shit like that. So yeah, literally all I've done this year is I've bought success. Now, obviously I've had to apply it. I've spent, I've worked my fucking face off. Um, but that's kind of been like the main, the main takeaway from this year is just, you can buy success. So as I said, I speak a lot about the coaches that I work with. So I have a affiliate marketing coach, a Facebook ads coach, uh, I have a peak performance coach. Um, you've already seen my cryptocurrency coach. Uh, I don't work with him that much because I have a long hold um, and a long term um, uh, cryptocurrency strategy uh, just because it's not really my thing. Uh, and I'm, I'm just, like in the over the next few years, I'm going to get a coach for everything. I'm going to get a vocal coach, um, you know, so I can speak with the conviction that I want to speak with. I can speak in different tones um, like, you know, I, I in my head, I, I want to become the superhuman, a superhuman by just like getting a coach for everything, like really investing into myself, right? So, you know, everyone speaks about the importance of, in, you know, investing into your self-education, but like, it's so, so true. Not only is it the knowledge that you get, number two, it's just the, it's the fact that you're saying like, look, this is, you know, I'm putting money on the line here. Like I'm committing, right? It's like burning the bridges, you know? So like, I would say, if I would say if you're a person who hasn't bought coaching or courses, the, I, all, the only thing that tells me is like you have no faith in yourself that you can execute because look, like say something like social media marketing. If you buy a course for a thousand dollars, like it's obvious you're going to make more than a thousand dollars. It is. If you put your mind to it, it is it, like you really have to fuck up not to make a thousand dollars back, at least in like your first three months, right? If you buy influencer ignited, like you would have had to done something seriously fucking wrong. Um, if you don't make a thousand dollars back in your first three months, like seriously wrong. Right. So I think anyone who doesn't buy coaching or courses, like they're just on in like uh, not confident in themselves, which, which is completely fine. Like I, I completely understand that. But, um, yeah, all I can do with my YouTube, with my personal brand is show you guys what I'm doing. You know, I, I we talk about honesty all here, like show you guys what I'm doing openly, honestly, 
Um, and you guys have already seen my cryptocurrency coach. I haven't shown you guys my Facebook ads coach. It's a guy called Jordan Schumacher. I think that's his last name. He, or uh, he owns um he has a Schumacher. He owns a, a paid traffic agency called Macher Macher Media. So some shit like that. Really really smart guy. Um, so yeah, I haven't shown you guys my peak performance coach. Now he's a guy called Gary Amers. Uh, he works with billionaires, um, CEOs, uh, top athletes. Um, his like offline presence is amazing. Super fucking expensive. Um, but luckily I give him some, um, digital marketing, uh, advice. So we have a lot of value arbitrage there. Um, just incredible, incredible guy. Now what you're actually going to see right now, and I'm just going to leave a couple clips is a coaching session from earlier today. We had a three hour coaching session where we talked a lot about, and I only started recording halfway because I realized like, shit, this would be a sick video. Um, and what you're going to see here is we delve a lot into my, my subconscious because your head and your heart tell you two different things. Your subconscious mind tells you you want success, but your subconscious mind has these limiting beliefs holding you back. So, um, you know, one thing that I do want to say guys is I, you know, I fully subscribe to Western philosophy. Like, you know, I have my Facebook ads coach. I have expensive courses on webinars, on funnels, on how to scale agencies, stuff like that. Like I, I know, I know the strategy, the strategy is there. It's in place and I'm working on it every day, but the strategy doesn't mean anything. If you don't have your subconscious, if you don't have your belief systems in accordance to what it is that you want. So I like sort of uh, delving into Eastern philosophy. I like doing meditation energy work because you know, that kind of, that kind of grounds me and that, that aligns what I know in my head and aligns it to my heart. Now, you know, if you told me this shit two years ago, the shit would have like flown by my ear. I'm like, like sit down for 20 minutes and just, just breathe and be with yourself. Like, are you fucking stupid? Like, I know I need to go work. Like shut the fuck up. Like, like, Thanks a lot, Iman, but I don't want to sit on a rock and like let shit manifest. But all I can say guys is most of you guys have a lot of baggage holding you back and it's really, really holding you back. And I'll be hundred percent honest with you guys. Like with things like my health, I do it out of inspiration um, with, and I'm, 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 I'm putting a lot on the line here, right? Um, with things like my health, I do it out of inspiration with things like reading, studying, I do it out of inspiration because I want to, I'll be honest when it comes to making money, I'm, and this is something me and my coach touch on a lot. Like it's still out of desperation. You know, like when I, the idea of money comes to my head, like what goes through my head, the initial thought is like, I don't ever want me and my mom to go through that again. You know, like I, like if I don't, if I don't make money, you know, if I don't take care of my family in the way that I wasn't able to before, like if I don't do that, like I'm a piece of shit. And like my family, when I say family, it's just me and my mom. Um, like my, my family's done, you know? And that, that brings a lot of pain. So, and I feel a lot of expectation on me. Okay? Like, I'll be honest, I feel a lot of pressure on me to perform at this point. Um, because you know, I, I went from this, like this nobody with a bunch of potential. I knew I had potential, but like I went from this person not delivering results to where I'm at now, which is doing somewhat okay. Um, and like, I, I feel that pressure every single day and it, it kind of weighs on me. Um, so, you know, I can honestly say like when it comes to money, I don't do it because I feel as though like, I don't do it because and the thought process in my head isn't Iman, you like do this because like you deserve it, right? It's like Iman, do this or like you're fucked or you're, you know, things go back to the way they used to be or like this, like those aren't, that is holding me back. And I know that, right? And that's a belief system that doesn't serve me. So, you know, that that's why it's quite cool to work with someone like Gary who does energy work, who does body, uh, body language work, um, uh, um, you know, physiology work, um, because like, here's the thing, a lot better frame to come at, you know, money success would be like, Iman, you know, like do this because you like, this is the best version of yourself. And you know, if you're really low on motivation and you really need a kick, do go Iman, do this because your mom needs you, you know, do this because you know, the more money you make, the more money you can help people, right? Like that's a, that's a positive way to come at it rather than doing it out of desperation. What happens if I don't do this, this is that. So you know, as I said, money is something that I still don't have the relationship with. Like I don't have a relationship, the sort of relationship with money that I want to have. And I guess that's just simply because like, you will be honest guys, like, like money is new to me. Like I've always had money around me because you know, I had a funny family situation. Um, you know, my, 
my, my mom and my dad, I'll, I'll tell you guys the full story one day. Um, as I said, I, I've said this in my emails and stuff, I have to protect certain people at this point. When I turn 18, I can, I can come out with a full story. My mom and my, or my, my real dad, he was uh, alcoholic abusive. Um, so he would just basically beat the shit out of my mom. Um, and so I've, I've never met him. He, he ran away. Um, but my stepdad and my mom, um, he, they, they were only married for legal purposes, basically. So I've always lived in this weird, like purgatory where like I went to a private school, you know, at the, the, where I'm living right now is like in Chelsea, which is a super nice area in London. But like, you know, I always had money around me, but I never had money myself because like, that's all he did. He did my, my stepdad would pay for my school and let us live in one of his houses. He's mega wealthy. Um, but then, you know, my mom's unemployed. My mom is, has come to a foreign country. She is just trying her best to take care of a kid, trying to make me this sort of man that she would want me to be. And I, she, I think she's done a good job. Um, so, you know, my, my point is with all this is my relationship with money isn't where I would have, where I want it to be simply because of my background, right? Long, long story short. So back to the point as to how like self investing my self education has been so important. You know, I like to invest in my self education, whether that's working with a, uh, with a coach like Gary, who helps with more the Eastern philosophy, what is my mindset, my mind state, um, at, or someone like Jordan, who's my Facebook ads coach, uh, he helps me, you know, the, Iman, this is how we're gonna run webinars for December. Uh, this is how we're gonna set up your affiliate program, stuff like that. Um, so yeah, this is gonna be very, very interesting for you guys. You're gonna see me literally being taught by my coaching, um, by my coach, you know, and once again, just, try to keep an open open mind to this because some of this will seem very very weird you weren't in my body at the time so you don't you don't know the sort of physiological changes that were happening so i'm gonna just play some clips right now for probably for the next few minutes uh and i will see you guys on the other side of that have you ever been in the car and then a song will come on mm -hmm. and then you as you hear the song you go oh that reminds me of and then you bring back the emotions of that song or someone has a smell or a scent and you go that reminds me of such and such. That's called an anchor. Whenever you're in a strong state of emotion and something unique happens or stimulus, you in time associate the stimulus to the feeling. Ivan Pavlov was a Russian physiologist and he did studies with dogs. And every time he'd show the dog steak, they'd get into that place of wanting the food and they'd bark and they'd growl or want the food and then he'd ring bells on the wall. Brrr. That's a lion protecting his cubs. No one's taking those fucking cups. Open your eyes, what's two plus two? Or three plus seven? Ten. Now go back to that memory. You see it? Mm -hmm. Make the picture bigger. Bring the picture closer to you. Closer. Double the picture in size. Where do you feel it when you connect to that feeling? It starts with the gut and permeates out. What's possible when you feel like that? No dense energy, just expansive. Expansive. What's possible when there's expansive energy? When the moment you wake up, you surround yourself with this frame. You adopt this frame, then go to the meeting. You adopt this frame, then you have the phone call. You adopt this frame, then you text. You adopt this frame, then you speak. You adopt this frame, then you go out and attract new people, places and things. You adopt this frame at all times. Right, well, like being able to change my state. Well, there's things that pull you out of the state. Uh -huh. And once those are fucking sorted out, you wouldn't be pulled out of the state. Mm -hmm. What things pull you out of the state? You get distracted by... Oh, uh, social media, phone, all the time. Mm -hmm. that's, that's probably the biggest one because like, half of it is my job. Now I'm at the point where like, there's more opportunity that I know what to do with. Like there's more people that I know what to do with. There's more everything that I know what to do with. So I, for now, it's like learning how to say no. I, I, 2018, I just want to like leave everything on the table. Like 2017, I went into 2017 just like not at a good place. Right, well, anything you can think of in terms of wealth. Yeah. What's your specific goal? Do you have a specific goal or not? 500K. 500K, it, it consistently or just in your account? Oh, uh, by the, no, 500K next year. So I, some of you guys will be like, dude, that was so awesome. Or like, dude, that was really fucking weird. I don't really understand. As I said, you guys don't have context for every single exercise that we were doing. But all I can say was 
that like that that sort of eastern philosophy work is is so important and be, working with gary is, is amazing because like he helps my energy he helps my state he helps just pull out some of the the, the bad b beliefs limiting beliefs that I've, I've put in i've put in place in terms of my life um so yeah i mean um it's it was i'm sure it was a very interesting video for you guys um that is in conclusion like investing in myself has been the best decision i've ever made and you know like when you're, at, I was at a low place, guys. Like, and it was so scary for me to invest in my, uh, in myself because I didn't have confidence in myself. Like, I was like, D dude, if I invest a thousand dollars into this course and I only have fourteen hundred in my bank account, like, and I fail, number one, I'm gonna look like an idiot, and number two, like, you know, like, w like what's left for me? But all I can say, guys, is, you know, whether it be me and my course or any other courses out there, I'm just saying, course in general, like these people what they want the best for you right so their course is there to ensure that you make your money back and you make 10x 100x returns so yeah all i can say is you know right iphone x is coming out like obviously I, i'm gonna buy it but like you know if some of you guys are gonna buy it and you have the iphone 7 uh and you don't have much money in your bank account don't you know don't buy the x right B buy the course but buy, buy the coaching because in three months you can buy four X's and then in a year you can buy a hundred X's like just, you know, play the long game because we're all playing the long game. I know if you're watching this, you're relatively young, even if you're 30, 40, you've still got so long to go. So I, uh, yeah, I hope this is an interesting insight as, uh, as to, you know, what, it, what it's like, uh, when I work with coaches and whatnot, um, and why investing in your uh, investing in your self-education will make you rich i guarantee that so um yeah guys daily uploads as usual i'm doing uh, U uh youtube lives every tuesday friday and saturday so go uh, down in the description and you're gonna see right next to the subscribe you're gonna see a bell click on that bell um click on that bell and you will get notified every single time i'm going on live and i will answer your videos face to face so that's pretty cool um and link to influencer ignited as i said i took it down from 997 pounds to 997 dollars so huge discount link to that in the description and uh yeah i'll see you guys tomorrow